The overall goal of this procedure is to evaluate glucose sensing in ventromedial hypothalamic, or VMH, neurons from older mice using membrane potential sensitive dye as an index of neuronal activity. This is accomplished by first performing cardiac perfusion to flush blood out of the brain of an anesthetized mouse prior to removal of the brain. The second step is to create coronal brain slices and dissect the VMH. Next, the VMH neurons are dissociated and cultured on cover slips. The final step is to measure the fluorescence of the neurons as glucose is decreased in the presence of membrane potential dye. Ultimately, each neuron's change in fluorescence is used to quantify the response of that glucose-inhibited neuron to glucose changes. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods such as electrophysiology is the ability to study neurons from adult mice. This allows us to study um, disease states in adulthood. Begin this procedure by placing the dissected brain on the chuck in the vibratome chamber. With the vibratome set to slow speed at level 2 and high amplitude at level 9, cut slices at 300 to 500 microns until reaching the hypothalamic area. Then, cut thin slices at 100 microns from the posterior to the anterior. To isolate the precise VMH region, Pay close attention to anatomical changes. At Bregma minus 2.